What's up YouTube? So this is my KZ440 gas tank. I'm going to be stripping it all down to uh, bare metal. And then I'm going to be clear coating it with adhesion promoter and we're going to see how clear looked gas tank. Not clear looked, bare metal looked gas tank. So basically this stuff that I got here is easy strip. I couldn't find any aircraft paint remover. So I went this is only stuff I could find for metal. But basically, it says to leave it for an hour, half an hour to an hour. So I decided just to test it on this little area first. And then depending on how well that goes, I will uh, do the rest of it. But some of the spots you can see don't really have anything on it because it's dripped off. But I'm probably going to have to use more than one coat anyway, so I'm not too worried about it. Just kind of take this little... Uh, credit red credit card thing and spread it around on there uh, so I basically want to strip the whole top of this tank except for the area around the gas cap that can stay black I'm thinking about doing the gas cap in black or just leaving it chrome I'm not sure yet we'll see how it looks with both chrome and then I need to get the logos for the side which I'm going to get all black I'll spray them all black and then the bottom of the tank here, I'll probably just leave in black just to protect it better. And it's not really rusted or anything. There's a little spot here, but I can just like spray some black over that and cover it. But it's not bad. Um, See, so yeah, I'm going to wait for an hour or so and then come back and see how well this did. Just a quick update. Um, it's been sitting for like half, half an hour, at least half an hour. I'm trying to scrape at it a little bit, and it's not doing fuck all. So I bought this paintbrush from the dollar store. I'm just going to fucking coat this whole, like, bottom half with it. And then I'm going to see what it's like. I'm going to leave it for a full hour, and we're going to see how long it, or uh, how much paint it takes off. So here it is with all the paint, or the uh, spread on with the paintbrush. You can already tell it, I don't know, kind of kind of separates a little bit in some spots but I don't know yeah I'll leave this for like an hour and then I'll check back and see what it looks like all right so it's been sitting for close to an hour anyway so we're just gonna take this kind of push it it's not even like any fucking sort of bit so we're actually gonna grab a paint scraper here it's a flat fucking paint scraper like this. Let's see if we can scrape any of this stuff. Oh, look at that. So you just gotta use the metal paint scraper. Now I'm gonna set the camera down. I'm just gonna uh, scrape this and I'll show you when I'm done. Alright, so that actually worked pretty well. Basically, just taking this and scraping it like that. These little nicks and shit don't really mean crap to me because I'm gonna wire wheel it anyway. Get a nice, like, clean brushed look. Probably wet sand it a little bit. Maybe, I don't know. We're basically just going to wire wheel and see what it looks like. And then I'm going to keep going until I get the look that I want. Just want to have, like, a brushed, brushed look on it. Uh, so I guess I'm going to uh, probably go from, like, here somewhere. And just cover that whole thing up like that. And go from there. And then uh, I'll leave that for an hour or so. I'll recover up all this because not all of it's scraping off, some of it's a little difficult. But we'll do that and go from there. Alright, so I got this all covered now. Um, I did just leave the front a little bit so that I have somewhere that I can hold while I'm scraping it. But uh, I covered this all up for the most part. We'll wait another hour or so and then uh, I'll come back and look at it. Give her another good scrape and... Obviously, I don't need to get all of it off because I'm going to be wire wheeling it. The only reason I don't just wire wheel the whole thing is because wire wheels are like fucking $14, whereas this one can of Easy Strip is $14. With uh, the wire wheel, it'd go through it a lot quicker trying to remove all the paint. And, uh, uh, 
the wire wheel will last a lot longer just trying to scuff up the metal a little bit to give it a nice clean look but yeah so another hour and then I'll come back and check this out all right back again it's been about another hour um, this one looks a little more pasty to be honest the more that I applied to it, it's kind of got this rust kind of like rusting a little bit but I think that's just the color um, so yeah, let's see. Yeah, it's coming off pretty good. I'm gonna, uh, probably put the camera back down. Yeah, it's coming off pretty good. Um, alright, so unfortunately, it looks like it's just getting at the clear coat. So I'm actually going to actually really, like, paste it on there. Because, uh, that was kind of a light coat. So it's to get pretty heavy on there, so... I guess I'll do that and let it sit for like an hour, maybe a little bit longer. If I get it really pasted on there, I'm going to cover the same section that I had. Just leave this a little bit up here for somewhere to kind of hold on to. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and do that. And I'll check back in about an hour. Alright, just showing you uh, the coat that I did here. I put it on pretty thick there. Um, it's these little spots, I don't know. There's nothing there. I don't know why, but like, I can brush it, get it all coated on there, but it'll still like fucking flake off of it. I don't know why that is, but basically, I'm just like spreading it around all over it. I'm trying to get lots of all the paint off, all this shit off of it. So I'll let that sit for, I don't know how long, maybe hour and a half, hour, but I'll probably come back and try to scrape it a little bit in like an hour. Because I'm hoping that this uh, actually uh, cleans it off pretty good, but we'll find out. That's why I'm doing this kind of review, so if anybody's trying to buy this shit, don't know whether it actually works or not. It says for metal, but like... I don't know. Doesn't seem like it works that great. It worked a little bit on that one spot. But that paint was kind of rubbed a little bit to begin with. So. We'll wait and see. Worst case scenario, I'm just going to have to sand it. But, I don't know. We'll find out. Alright, so it's been about an hour and 15 minutes or so. So you can see that it actually looks really pasty now. You can see all the pasted spots on here. I'm hoping that, uh, yeah, it looks like it's scraping a little bit, but not a lot. I'm probably going to have to put some pressure on it, but, uh, yeah, I'm going to try to scrape this, then I'll check back in. All right, so the final verdict on this, uh, easy strip is it's pretty much a dud. See, like, it worked well on this area over here this is the first initial coat that i did right on this spot and uh i guess the paint was actually kind of like it looked like it was worn and it actually stripped off really nicely in there but once i hit like this edge here it just like stopped working and now like this doesn't do anything at all it's just that's like all i had to do for the other spot now it's Got like nothing. You like putting pressure on it. It does like fuck all. Like there's a little bit. That was only clear coat. So like probably would literally have to go at this for hours to get it to do anything. 